Hey everyone, it's Brenda with Stampin' Up! here with another video for you. Today I've got some Christmas napkin cards to show you. And I think they turned out really super cute. And um, I'm also going to be hosting a Christmas napkin giveaway. So if you're interested in winning some of these napkins, you're going to need to be a subscriber and leave me a comment below and tell me which card is your favorite. And you will be entered to win. So, um, I want to do uh, tell you that I am recording this um, while I'm still recovering from my concussion. So, I'm not doing a tutorial today, but I do have a napkin card tutorial series that I filmed a few months ago. And I will put the links below in case you don't know how to make a napkin card. Um, so, if you are interested in that, like I said, the link will be below. And so let me just show you um, the napkins I'm using here. Okay, so the first one is, the first two I have are these old-fashioned Christmas looking napkins. All right, so I made a card with each of these. And then I have some Snoopy napkins. I've got this one here, the Snoopy on the doghouse. And I have the Peanuts one. Um, if you did watch my napkin tutorial series, um, you saw a card that I made um, with this one last year. But I did make another one um, for this um, uh, this year. So that's the one I'm going to be showing you. And then I have one more napkin. Now this I do not have multiples of. This, all of these napkins I own. I, I bought packs of these. So these are easy to give away. This one, I love this one. It's actually my favorite, but I only have a couple of these left because I had got them in a swap. So I only have two of these to give away. I have more of these to give away if I, if I get a good enough uh, response. I don't know exactly how I'm going to do it yet. All I know right now is what I'm going to do is I'm going to give away um, one of each of these napkins to two people, okay? So two people will win one of each of these, okay? And then that's all I have of this one. And then one person will win a couple of each of these. So I will have six winners, okay, if I have that big of a response. The last time I tried to do a giveaway, I got absolutely no response whatsoever. So um, we'll just see what happens. Um, so... Um, if you win this napkin, for instance, you'll get two of them. And each napkin actually has two panels. Or, I mean, if you want, leave me comments if you have any um, ideas. I could do more of those. Um, actually, I mean, what I really could do is um, everybody could win one of each of all these because I have a lot of them. So um, let's just do that. So um, two people will win all five napkins and then four people will win one, uh, one of each of these okay so that's a little easier um, but do tell me what um, card is your favorite because uh, that would be fun and I may host uh, more giveaways in the future if I have a good response for these napkin giveaways because I have a ton of napkins so let me just show you the cards I made so um, the first one is the little reindeer and um, I think it turned out really cute. You know, I like the stickles, so I had to put the little stickles on there. And um, this is Real Red and Pecan Pie cardstock from Stampin' Up. And Tis the Sweet Season came from a retired stamp set. Um, that is called Candy Cane Season. And um, I used the deckled rectangle dies on almost all of these cards. All right. Just so you know that. And, okay, so on the inside, I did Wishing You an Old Fashioned Christmas. And that comes from the new Rocking Horse set that is in the Holiday Mini Catalog. Okay. And I'd use the same sentiment on the next card as well. Um, okay, and that is the Santa. Okay. I did a little stickles on there too. I don't know if that's coming across or not. 
Um, Tis the season to be jolly. Came from another retired set called Holly Jolly Wishes. I think this was out last year or the year before. I'm not sure. And then, of course, like I said, on the inside, it's the same sentiment. Um, this is Cherry Cobbler and Shaded Spruce. Okay, so that's those two. The Peanuts ones. All right, so this is how that turned out. I did stickle the snow. All right. Um, Happy Christmas Wishes comes from Festive and Fun, which is in the new holiday mini catalog. This is Boho Blue and Shaded Spruce. And on the inside, this sentiment comes from Wishes All Around. All right, right here. This is also in the new mini catalog. Okay, that's the third card. My fourth card is Snoopy on the Doghouse, and I stickled the lights. Wishing you a festive Christmas comes from Trucking Along. Okay, this is an online exclusive that is still available. And um, the inside is that same sentiment. This is Poppy Parade cardstock. Okay. Uh, this die is actually from Radiating Stitches Dies. This is also an online exclusive. I use this big one right here. All right. And then the last card is the one that I only have a couple of these napkins and it's my favorite. Look how pretty this turned out. It is so cute. And don't you just love Snoopy? I mean, who doesn't love Snoopy? And I did the same, uh, wishing you a festive Christmas. Um, these I did cut out with um, the Something Fancy dies. It has this little tiny die right here. And that's what I used to cut these um, sentiments out with. And um, this is Balmy Blue and Blueberry Bushel. And um, all of the napkins were made with the subtle 3D embossing folder, which is retired. Um, but if you have this one, this is like the best one, I think, for napkin cards. You, you can pretty much use any embossing folder that you want, but you really want something that is um, going to put pressure on the entire napkin to make sure that it adheses well to your white card stock, okay? Um, but you really can use any... Um, any embossing folder that you want. So anyway, these are my napkin cards. Um, I may host more napkin giveaways in the future, just depending on how this one goes. And um, so leave me a comment, be a subscriber, leave me a comment, let me know which one you like the best. And then I will be picking my winners. Um, I want to give everybody a few days to um, see my videos because not everybody's on YouTube every day. So Let's just say um, next Monday I will pick my winners and make an announcement on Tuesday, which will be the 14th. Um, wait a minute. I'm getting, I'm getting mixed up. This is, um, no, it's going to be the following week. This is coming out on the 15th. I have to keep in mind when I'm putting my videos out. Let me get my calendar real quick just to be sure that I'm telling you the right information. Okay. So the napkin, this is the 15th, so that's where I got mixed up. So I will make my, um, uh, pick the winners on the 20th, which is Monday. And then on the 21st, I will make my announcement, or I might even make it on the 20th. So that's why you definitely need to make, make sure that you're a subscriber. Hit the little bell button so you don't miss a video. And then um, when I tell you who the winners are, it will also be in the description. Um of, I will put it in the description of this video as well as in the announcement video. And then you will have um, just like a couple days to get the addresses to me so that I can get them sent to you so you can make Christmas cards with these this season. So because it's Thanksgiving, um, I do want to give you a little time to get the addresses. So um, I'll give you till, you know, Saturday the 25th 
to get me those addresses and I will be giving you my email address for that. And then I can get them sent out ASAP after that and hopefully you can get some cards made for your family and friends. Anyway, so that is it for today. Have a great week. Don't forget to check Fridays. I have my um, holiday projects uh, videos. So um, this Friday is Christmas tags um, with a one little Hanukkah tag as well. So um, stay tuned for that and have a great week and God bless. Bye-bye.